Hello everyone, welcome back to Guitar Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix the Windows Store something happened on our end and how we can fix this up so that we can really get into this step. So the first step for most step is all about we just need to go over here, search for the run command and you have to open the run command and right now we need to search for wsreset.exe and you have to press enter. And which is going to open your Microsoft Store. So uh, it is going to give like a fresh start for the Microsoft Store, which is going to fix the issue up. And right now, most probably it is going to help you guys out. So you can try this out. If still, if it's not working, we have to move to the next step. Next step is all about just go over here, search for the PowerShell over here, and you have to click on run as administrator and go for yes. Right now, we need to copy paste a command over here. So what I'm going to do is I have already copied this, which I'll be providing this in the description. So you don't have to worry, copy this and you have to go over here and you have to paste it. And once it pastes, just press enter. So what it's, it's going to do is it is going to restore the Microsoft Store. And once afterwards, if you open the Microsoft Store, it will not be having the trouble with these. So you have to open this as well. Next one is all about what we need to do is just go over here, search for the settings and you have to click on this one and right now directly navigate to over here in the network and internet and right now go to the VPN first. So if you're already connected to a VPN, right now as you can see I have not yet connected to any VPN which is fine but if you're already connected to a VPN you have to disconnect it and you have to check if the VPN is not connected. We can most probably find with it but if uh, if it's already connected you have to try disconnecting and you have to check this is what you have to do next one is all about what we need to do so we just need to move to the next one that just go over here search for apps over here or you can search for settings and you have to click on this one and right now we need to directly navigate to apps over here and navigate to install and apps and right now what we need to do just keep scrolling down and navigate to system components over here and you can directly navigate to system components and over here in the system components if you scroll down, you can see over here you have system components, select this one. And right now over here in the system components, you'll be having few more apps like the Microsoft Store and just go over here in the Microsoft Store. If you find the Microsoft Store, you have to just go and click on three dot menu over here to go for advanced options. And right now in the advanced option, what we need to do is you just, you'll be getting options like these. For example, what it's going to do is you'll be getting options if you scroll down and the reset will be having options for repair, go for the repair and also go for the reset as well. So it might be logged you out with what if you already logged in, you can just log in back and you have to check and that's also fine with that. Next step is all about what we need to do is after trying with this, we just need to go over here, search for the run command over here and click on the run command. And this time we have to type services over here dot msc and go for enter. And right now we're just going over here and we have to search for Microsoft install service. So just go over here search for the microsoft installed service so keep scrolling down and over here you can see this is over here and right now we need to go here go to the properties and right now what we need to just make sure if it is manual change this to automatic and also go for apply and if the status running if the status run is it is stopped you have to make sure it is running and go for okay and also right click on this one and go for the restart as well so once it's restart is successfully done we just need to close this and you have to check with the store and still if you're having the trouble with the store just go over here search for the cmd and click on run as administrator and go for yes and right now we need to type sfc put a space slash go over here scan now and you have to press enter and this is going to take a little bit of time so we need to wait because it's going to do a complete scan on a system and that's going to help you guys out as well so these are the steps and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification that's it bye bye